Hi, my crafty friends. Listen, we are going to do a really simple and fun project. So it's going to be a nativity clothespin ornament. Now, you guys, the star I got from the Dollar Tree. Then I had a little piece of a craft stick laying around. These two little rounded clothespins. And then I'm going to actually use a little... Um, half wooden bead and we're just going to start building this thing now you guys I'm just going super slow on cutting that piece of the um, craft stick because sometimes if I cut it too quickly I'll break the whole thing apart and I totally don't want to do that so we're going to kind of round the edges just a little bit on it since everything else kind of has a bit of a rounded edge um, and then once I get that done the way I want it then we will hot glue the little half bead on to it. Now you totally wouldn't have to use a little half bead. If you wanted to use a full bead, you could, but this will just um, mimic baby Jesus's head um, on the ornament as we put it together. So I was kind of thinking about how I wanted to, um, if I wanted to paint this or stain this. And since those two rounded um, clothespins that I have, are from a long time ago. They've kind of got their own patina. So I thought, ooh, let's use some of the pickling wash that I've had. And we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna paint it up with that. And then we're gonna do a little bit of distressing. Now, you guys, if you don't have pickling wash, no worries. It's really almost kind of like a stain anyways. But I love, love, love this color. And I'm so sad because I can't find this color anywhere anymore. And I'm like, ah, I need to start making it again. So once that's all dried up, you guys, I'm just kind of wrapping a little piece of um, sandpaper around my little paintbrush there just to kind of give me, you know, a little bit of pressure. And I'm just going to sand around on some of the parts of it, uh, kind of around the edges and stuff like that. Um, I was thinking this would have been really cool to just kind of leave in its natural um, colors as well. That would be fun. I think I would have probably done that if my clothes pins would have been the newer ones. So it was all more of the raw uh, wood looking color. But anyways, I'm liking how this is going. And I was even thinking, man, it would be fun to do like that crackle finish on it. Also, you know how we did with the Elmer's glue? I think that would be really fun as well. So I'm just gonna put a little hanger on the back of it. Like I said, this is an easy peasy one which you know, I love easy crafts so very much. Um, and then we can hang this on the tree and have it year after year. We can write our names on the back, add in the year, because if y'all are like me, I have ornaments on my tree from when I was a kid. Yeah, when I was a kid. So here's how it turned out. I think it's just adorable. Thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to follow the page for more crafts. Thank you so much, friends.